Okay, so when you're about to scan, the first thing you want to do is open the scanner bed up. You'll find a microfiber rag if you're the first person to scan. I would like you to wipe down the scanner bed to get rid of fingerprints or dust. Next, you take your image, your document, and lay it face down on the scanner bed and close the lid. That's the first step of scanning. All right, so we're now going to scan and import a file into the computer. This file will be the sketches from the Do I Have a Right uh, currency making assignment. So we are going to use image capture just because that's a generic program that Apple uses for any scanner. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my spotlight search, type in the word image. So don't keep it on the dock in the lab. Image capture will auto fill in, press return, and you'll find something up and down on your dock opens and you're going to see the name of the scanner from uh, your row. It immediately starts what's called an overview scan which will get a quick glimpse of what you would like to scan or the document that's in the scanning bed and what you can do now is just select the sketch or sketches that you want to use for the assignment. You're going to pick your favorite one. If you have time, you can fill them all in. Uh, I don't really like that scientist one. I have a competitive eating contest one, but for my currency, I think my best design is probably this poet. So I select it. We're going to name it. You'll call it your room number, or you know what, let's put name, room number, and the money sign, shift four. Scan two, you wanna make sure it's in your Dropbox in your room number, since 211 is a computer lab, I'm just gonna put it in this kindergarten folder just so we find it. And format will be JPEG. You wanna make sure it's there. Uh, resolution, you can stick with 150, will be fine. Notice the bounding box is around the image that I want. And the name. Room number, just double check everything. Black and white is fine because we'll be scanning it, or I'm sorry, we'll be uh, adding color to it using Sumo Paint, which the next video will demonstrate. Press scan. Scanning Mr. D211 money. Once it's done, since it's a JPEG, you could just see how it scans, double click it. We'll open it in preview. And there's the money. The next video will show how we paint these using Sumo Paint.